Hi, it's Pekka. In this video, I'm going to give you a quick introduction to Robot Framework. The key thing to remember about Robot Framework is that it's a generic automation framework. What generic means is that it's uh, not tied to certain interface, like for example, web, uh, web automation or for REST APIs, databases, or something like that. But it's a generic automation framework that you can use with any of those technologies and many others. It also means that uh, Robot Framework is not only a test automation tool, but it's a generic tool that you can use for any kind of automation, including robot, robotic process automation. Robot Framework is implemented using the Python programming language, and Python is also the language you use when extending it. Robot Framework is open source, meaning that it's freely available, and we have an active community around it. The community has created a large ecosystem of consisting of various different tools and libraries that you can use, and if they are not enough, you can extend the framework easily. Robot Framework origins are in my master's thesis that, that I did in 2005, and after that, it was developed internally at Nokia Networks until 2008, when it was open sourced. Nokia Networks was sponsoring the tool development until 2015, when that role was taken by the Robot Framework Foundation that is currently sponsoring the development. 